Hi guys, Barnaby for Spurred on. This is your Monday edition of 7 o'clock Spurs. The Berahino debate has reopened again. The Guardian did a big piece yesterday, or might have been Saturday, saying that Jeremy Peace has made his peace with Daniel Levy, that Berahino has impressed West Bromwich Albion by coming out and saying he regretted sending that tweet, saying that he would never play for the club again. And because of this, the deal for Berahino to come to Spurs in the summer is on. Now, Berahino's contract runs out in 2017, so there'll only be a year left on it. Let's not forget that back in August, we offered £25 million in instalments for him. But with a year left on his contract, I don't think we can pay that again. I don't think we can pay as much as £25 million. Uh, so I wonder what the transfer fee would potentially be if this goes through. I'd be happy to pay 15 million, I think that sounds about right. Obviously Jeremy Peace at West Brom will hold out, but if they really have made peace with each other and they're getting on him and Daniel Levy, let's not forget we did uh, let Alex Pritchard go to West Brom on loan, so that will have taken some negotiation. I think 15, 16 million for Berahino would be a good signing for everyone. Good deal for West Brom, good for us. He'll play well either in the three behind Harry Kane or he can play at, instead of Harry Kane if he needs a rest up top. Young English striker, a great finisher, lots of talent. I think that's a deal that would suit Spurs. Possibility rating of that one, I'm putting it up to four out of five. Come on, Barahino, come and join the revolution at Spurs. Second bit of news today. Uh, Maurizio Pochettino has come out and said that not only is Deli Alli nursing his ankle injury that he did a couple of weeks ago in the warm-up, uh, I, I can't remember who it was against, was it Watford? I can't remember, no it wasn't Watford, it was after that. Anyway, most importantly, he's also got a knee injury as well as that ankle injury. Uh, and it's about nursing these youngsters through. Obviously Deli Alli is suspended against Dortmund on Thursday night, so that will give him a bit of a rest. Hopefully enable him to be nice, good and fit for Aston Villa away on Sunday afternoon, 4 p.m. kickoff, which will be a huge game to get us back on track after two games in which we haven't won in the Premier League. Anyway, still second in pl second place in the league, let's face it. If anyone had said to us, back in August, you'll be second place in the league with nine games to go, five points behind top, we'd have gone, are you kidding me? No, we're not. That's what's happening. So let's be positive. Keep behind the boys, guys. Uh, let me know what you thought of those news stories in the comment section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel on YouTube and follow us on Twitter at Spurred on TV. Come on, you Spurs. Hi, guys. Bumby for Spurred on. Outside the lane, it finished Tottenham 2, Woolwich 2. I don't know if my heart can take much more of that.